Morning, everybody. It's uh, 839 on this Wednesday morning, the 7th of June. Uh, this is your pre-opening comment, video number 1785. Okay, uh, Asia down slightly, Europe um, mixed on ECB talk that there's more work to be done on uh interest rates and inflation, Chinese exports down seven and a half percent. And as it relates to exports, we still have that uh, labor deal over in uh, L.A. at the L.A. port in Long Beach, especially. Um, Negotiations continue, hasn't gotten out of hand yet, but, you know, probably will. Um, Economic news this morning, uh, mortgage apps. This is kind of strange uh, because the mortgage website says down 14%. And uh, briefing and uh, market wire say down 1.4%. Either number doesn't really matter. Uh, there really wasn't much of a reaction to it. And, you know, let's face it the housing market is quiet because of the imbalance supply and demand. Uh, trade deficit, $74.6 billion. That's uh, the worst since last October. Expectations was about 75. So uh, we came in, I think the um, revised number for last month uh, if I recall, was seven, uh, 64.2. So uh, 64.2 to 74.6. I don't know that that really much matters since they'll probably revise it anyway. Um, since 7 a.m. this morning, the market has done nothing. Uh, when I came into the office at 7 it was Dow down 16, NASDAQ up 10, S&P up 2 at 8 o'clock. It had turned positive from down 16 to up 12, currently up 7. NASDAQ had gone from up 10 to up 34, currently up 25. S&P from up 2 to up 6 currently right in the middle, up four. Uh, Netflix gets an upgrade from J.P. Morgan. Um, new price target, 470. Uh, the stock is 415, up a little over uh, 15 bucks or 4%. Going in the other direction, we have United Food with inline revenues and a miss on earnings and they are taking this one to the woodshed uh 2070 down 687 or 25 percent uh grandma yellen was on uh cnbc this morning her jovial ignorance is bliss attitude um all smiles nothing to say um in the grain markets, we have soybeans and wheat slightly higher, the rest of them lower, oil up 85 cents, uh, heating oil up two cents, gasoline up a penny, um, and net gas up about five and a half cents. Uh, gold down 650, it was up 750 yesterday. Silver down three and a half cents, it was up about three and a half cents yesterday. Copper up uh, 1.6 cents. Uh, platinum up, palladium down, and for anybody who cares, aluminum foil looks like it's getting more expensive. Uh, in the soft, we have cotton down 75 cents and the coffee up a dollar ten. Um, sugar up 14 cents. As I said, the uh, futures are basically flat. The dollar is down 18 cents at 103.89. Uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum both lower. Bonds dead even unchanged. Um, as far as other early morning news, we have Dave and Buster's symbol play 35 and a half about uh, up a dollar 70 or 5%. They beat on 
earnings missed on revenue. That seems to be the story. Um, and the reason for that is everybody can screw around with their earnings. Nobody can talk about their revenues without using the numbers. Campbell's CPB, Campbell's Pork and Bean, beats by three cents. Revenues in line uh, reaffirms fiscal year 23 earnings guidance and revenue guidance. Um, 49.30 down, $1.29. Um, Casey's General Store misses by 15 cents, misses on revenues. Uh, and expects 24 inside same store sales to increase three and a half percent. That's versus current up six and a half percent. Increases the quarterly dividend 13 percent to 43 cents a share. The stock is 215 down nine and change. Uh, Petrobas upgraded to equal weight at Morgan Stanley. Twelve ninety six up thirty one cents. Coinbase up a dollar seventy. Not bad. Came down from what sixty eight to fifty three. Up a dollar. So uh, United Health uh, increased fourteen uh, percent increase of its quarterly cash dividend. It was down hard also with um, yesterday. Uh, today up a dollar fifty three or three tenths of a percent yesterday's two big movers in the Dow were United Health and Merck uh, Marvell has secured Amazon artificial intelligence order according to Taiwan Liberty Times Marvell 6232 up 318 5.4 percent. Uh, that one actually had a pretty good week last week, too. My recollection is maybe earnings. In any event, uh, Dow roaring ahead, up 10.72. S&P up 3.5. NASDAQ up 26. Really big numbers today. Uh, the important news, as far as I'm concerned, doesn't come until 3 o'clock. That's the April Consumer Credit. Uh, estimate is uh, $21 billion. Prior is twenty-six and a half. And at 10.30, we have the uh, EIA crude oil inventories. Expectation is for a build of 4.49 million barrels. Be careful out there. Have a good day.